dear friends last two videos we have done trading and profit and loss account calculations today we are going to do the balance sheet of final accounts from the balance balance sheet we can find out how much assets and liabilities have a firm have how much liabilities and assets let us go to the trail balance where we marked the entries to be booked in the balance sheet there on the debit side business premises sun sundry debtors furniture and fittings bank deposit and cash in hand these are the entries we have to keep in the balance sheet on the from the debit side of the trail balance these entries will be either on the asset side or liability side now from the credit side there is capital sundry creditors and reserve funds these three entries also we brought into the balance sheet in addition to this all the adjustment mentioned along with the trial balance to be included in the balance sheet so let us make the balance sheet balance sheet has two sides instead of debit and credit we write liabilities and assets on liability side we brought forward net profit or net loss from the profit and loss account to the debit side here we have net profit 17376 that net profit and capital to be added then we get the sum of capital and net profit is 47376 as per trial balance and profit and loss account next from the adjustment we know that there is a outstanding wage of 500 and outstanding salary of 1200 this also our liabilities these two we have to paid in the in this year but due to some reason we couldn't pay this amount so it is outstanding outstanding liability next sundry creditors is 13800 as per trial balance reserve funds reserve funds also like a capital which is to be utilized for the firm so that is also a liability so on the liability side all entries are made by us then next go here we going to asset side asset side from the trail balance business premises is an asset next is sundry debtors sundry debtors is 18000 but as per adjustment there is a provision for 2% of bad debtors that is 344 as per the profit and loss account statement so that 344 to be deducted from the sundry debtors we get 17656 next asset is furniture and fittings furniture and fittings is 2200 the value of furniture and fittings is 2200 as per the trial balance but there is a depreciation of 2% as per the adjustment that value is 110 we already find in the 
profit and loss account that 110 to be reduced from the 2200 we catch 2200 minus 110 is equal to 2090 so all adjustments we brought to the balance sheet next bank deposit is an asset then prepaid insurance prepaid insurance is another adjustment that is 200 that's an asset we already paid insurance which which need to be paid on the next year only that is prepaid insurance 200 it's an asset As to cash in hand, 1530, closing stock, 20,600. After entering the closing stock in trading account, next we enter the closing stock in the profit and loss uh, in the balance sheet only. So, closing stock has presence of, presence of closing stock is two places one is at a trading account another is at a balance sheet now all the adjustments are reflected in the balance sheet next let us make the sum of both the columns we get 60,076 60, is the balanced statement of the firm Now we have reached at the end of this final accounts. Dear friends, now we have found the trading profit and loss and balance sheet of a firm using the trial balance. Now we have reached at the final accounts and found the gross profit and net profit of the firm. Also, balance of liabilities and assets. In future, we will meet again to solve this type of questions. By the time, I wish all of you a best future for life. Thank you.